Make sure to stick around to the end of the video because all of these are going to one of you. The Trap Street playing card tuck box on the front, top, and back will make it look like a road. On the bottom, you'll have the TS Trap Street logo and the Trap Street cards. And then the one side says the streets and the other side also says the streets. The inside tuck flap continues the road and the two inside tuck flaps are black with the entire inside of the tuck box being white. Now that's all I can say for this tuck box, so let's take a look at the card inside. The back design is just the same as the tuck box where it's black with two yellow stripes going vertical all the way through the border, making it a broken border, which will, all of this will make packet cuts look phenomenal. Your faces have all been redone to where they have a black line behind the yellow cards, which were previously red, or a yellow line behind the black cards. All of your pips and indices have all been redone and hollowed out along with a custom number font. All of this to be said, I am absolutely in love with these faces. And this makes it even more of a cardistry deck to where you can do cardistry with both sides. Your court cards are going to be bicycle standard, again with your pips and indices hollowed out, your custom font, and now all done in black and white. Except for this time, your black cards have a yellow background, and your yellow cards, which were previously red, have the two black lines behind it. Outside of that, everything is going to be standard, and absolutely beautiful all the way through. You will receive opposite colorway jokers, yellow words and black lines versus black words and yellow lines, and they are two-way, meaning you can flip them upside down and get the same result. You get two ad cards, one with the standard back design and one opposite, and the other is a double backer. And last but not least, we have the four aces. We have the ace of diamonds, clubs, hearts, and spades. Now since they are all power aces, I do usually like my ace with spades to be a little bit better than the other three, so in this case I probably just would have not hollowed out the ace of spades here, but I do still like it a lot. I also received two stickers, one with the TS logo, done in black with yellow lettering. The other one has trap street cards with yellow and black lettering. And the last one was a six of clubs that says thanks Elijah from TSC. You'll also want to know if this deck can pharaoh shuffle, so from bottom to top you will see that it pharaohs perfectly absolutely every other one no problems there and then from top to bottom which is normally where decks have a little bit more of a struggle again every other one so if you're just learning to pharaoh shuffle i would 100 percent recommend this deck and if you haven't learned already i do have a tutorial which i'll have up at the top and in the description below Next is what is this deck going to feel like when you receive it. So when it comes to thickness, this deck is going to be right down the center just like your normal bicycle deck. And then how it actually is going to feel in your hand is just like almost every other deck where it has a lot of snappy, a lot of buttery, feels perfect in every way. Now should you buy this deck of cards? Well I think it depends on who you are. If you're a magician, I probably wouldn't pick this deck up. The back design isn't suited for it, pun intended, and the faces are overly customized where it'd be hard for the spectators to notice. If you're a cardist, as you saw in the intro, I would 100% pick this deck up. It looks absolutely beautiful unless you're someone who mostly relies on fans, because at that point, it's really not gonna do much because the sides are all done in black. If you're trying to do things that are going up your arm where you spread it up like this, that would work great because now you're going to get that line going all the way down it. But for the most part, I would 100% pick this deck up, especially if you're into packet cuts. For collecting, I would 100% say yes as well. Now it's not a normal collector's deck where it's extremely rare or extremely pricey, but it's a really cool deck of cards and would look great on a shelf like that. This deck won't work very well for gameplay because of how overly customized it is, plus I don't want my friends using a cool deck of cards like this, they tend to ruin them. And lastly, is this a hype deck? Heck no. Now all that you have to do to win both of these stickers and a free sealed deck of Trap Street cards is make sure to subscribe to the channel and ring the bell so you can be notified when videos drop. Number two is comment hashtag giveaway down in the comments. And number three, make sure you live in the United States and you're all set. Now please make sure you only do it one time per person and not per account. If you have multiple accounts and your sister has one that you use or whatever, I don't care. One per person so everyone has a fair and equal chance. And if you'd like me to do anything else, like take the cellophane off and sign this, put an extra card in there from a bicycle deck and sign that, or do anything else just kind of weird and kind of fun, I'd be down to do whatever, so just let me know when I reach out to you and I will get all that taken care of. Now how are you going to know who wins? It'll be posted on the community tab of this channel in exactly two weeks, and I'll be reaching out through the comments, replying to whoever comment won. 
If you have any more questions, just DM me on Instagram or I'll leave a comment down below. Probably DM I'll be able to reach back to you faster on because I check those a little bit more often. But either way, I'll see if I can get back to you as fast as I can with any questions that you may have about winning these cards. Speaking of Instagram, make sure to check out Trap Street Cards Instagram and website and I'll leave them in the description and on the pinned comment so you guys can check them out for being honestly just really freaking awesome. So I'll catch you guys in the next one. Please make sure to enter to win all this for yourself. This is Card Perfect, signing off.